Odessa Yonkers moved to the 49507 as a teen and has seen the growth within the community and surrounding areas in her 35 plus years living in Grand Rapids. After the passing of her father and witnessing numerous family members suffer from dietary related illness, Odessa began a personal mission to learn about overall wellness. She's implemented healthy practices into her and her family's lifestyle and is now educating others on how to do the same in her role at Southeast Market and also through Wellness with Odessa, which she started during the pandemic. Odessa's passion for wellness led her to pursue a certificate in food nutrition and health. When the owners of Southeast Market reached out to her, she knew this would be a perfect match, as the work they're doing around food and racial justice is something Odessa is passionate about. Let's find out what goes into a healthy lifestyle through food with Odessa Yonkers in this segment of My American Recipe. Thank you so much for being here with me today. Talk with me a bit about what we're making. We're going to start with the black eyed pea salad. Mm -hmm. It's a really fun, easy salad to make. What made you pick these dishes? Were you just a black eyed peas fan? Uh, I am a big, <laughs> I am a big black eyed pea fan. I grew up on black eyed peas. I'm from the South, but also Southeast Market, the owners, it's like one of the, their recipes that they have issued for their produce bundle subscription participants. Wonderful. Yeah. We're gonna start with our fresh veggies here. We're just gonna cut. We're chopping away, and I yes. see lots of colors in this bin yes. right now. Is this gonna be a really colorful salad? Yes, it is. I know Southeast Market has a really big emphasis on food equity, specifically in that area code. Will you talk with me about just what that means to you personally being from the area? I grew up in the 49507 area. A lot of fresh produce was not available. I saw a lot of illnesses. I had a lot of family members who died from diabetes, heart disease. Just to know that there are people out there that cares about food equity in 49507 area means a lot to me. Thank you for giving me this job. I feel like I'm, I'm doing a lot yeah. and I'm not doing very <laughs> Thank much. Thank you for so helping. There we go. <laughs> I've always wanted to um, help people with their diets. Food is medicine, definitely. And I just want to educate people on eating healthier. You know, it's not as hard as what people think. Like, oh, it's super hard to eat healthy, it's expensive, and it really is not. With Southeast Market, they're making it affordable, making food accessible to people in the 49507 area. You can have healthy, you can have affordable food. That's yeah. what we're doing. Wonderful. And then we're just going to ch shake it up in this jar here. Love it. Is this where you jar. do like a little dance in the kitchen? <laughs> there we go. <laughs> love it, love it. Nutritious and delicious. I'm excited to see that. And next beautiful. One. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> All right, for this next salad, we had to rope in our friend Ron Fudge because, well, he helped create the recipe. Tell me a bit what we're making today. Sure, we are making what's called a pear cabbage salad, right? And this salad was inspired by the pear and by Miss Odessa. So we have this foodie relationship where she brings over food and I take a look in the bag and I said, let's see what we can do with this. And so we started with a pear and I just took a taste of it and I said, you know, I think this would pair well with I a cabbage salad. I see what you did there. Pear, pear well. Yes. I see yes. what you see? did. <laughs> see? And, and, and so with the sweetness of the pear and the bitterness of the cabbage, it's really good with a red wine. So we'll start with the dressing. We'll okay. just get that out, out the way. Take the salad here. Thank Look you, at chef. your teamwork go. 
Teamwork makes the dream work. We are that, man. I feel like I have to say it, because it's just right there, but you make a good pair. Oh, wait till you see us dance. Oh, man. Oh, oh, do my you guys gosh. dance in the kitchen often? All Absolutely. the time. Why are All you the busting time. a move right now? Oh, hey, <laughs> put on the music. Let's go. <laughs> All right, let's oh give her gosh. a move. <laughs> We dance, we uh, make food, create recipes, and just have a good time. Love it, we love to see it. Who's ready for some appetizers? Let's go. Yay. All right, Let's talk to me it. about what we're making. Our next recipe is going to be a mushroom goat cheese toast. We're going to be using ingredients from Southeast Market. This is really, really simple to make, and it's really delicious. Now we are going to add in our mushrooms. I want to know just about the work that you're doing right now with the Southeast Market. I've been with the Southeast Market for about three months now. I am the lead associate there. The owners saw that there was a need. There was a lack of access to fresh produce, fresh healthy foods. So they saw that need and they wanted to fill the need. And that's what we're doing. Would you consider that area prior to the market coming in as something uh, like a food desert? It really was. Every corner you have a store, but it's usually filled with alcohol or processed foods. It was really hard to find fresh foods in that community, and we're making that change. One of our programs that we have is called Pay It Forward. Yeah. And what that is about is when you come into the store, if you wanted to round up your purchase to the nearest dollar, if you wanted to add five, ten dollars, or whatever you wanted to add, feel free. I mean, sometimes people come in and they're very generous and we, we're so appreciative of that. But what that does is it allows us to offer all of our produce to our customers or to the participants in the 49507 area at cost. Mm -hmm. That means there's no upcharge there's no up cost. When people, they learn about it, they've just been so generous. So you guys are also offering produce bundles as well. Can you talk with me about how that works? I know you brought some here too, which is what we were cooking with. Yes, right now we are offering produce bundles to our customers where you could get curated boxes or curated bins of fresh produce. If you wanted to come in and you, you know, got your bundle and you wanted to donate to someone in the community, you can do that. We also just started our EBT bundle program, and this is going to be so helpful to so many people. EBT participants can come in, get a $20 bundle for $5. That is what we've really been pushing in another way that we can help the community to have better access to healthy foods. We've got our salads and our appetizers ready. We're ready for a summer party. Absolutely. Right. Perfect. Well, thank you guys so much for taking time to come in and show us some of these great recipes. Thank you for having us, Kylie. Absolutely. For more recipes like this, as well as more fresh and local produce, be sure to check out the Southeast Market.